everyone, it's Christine here. So we're doing week 17 of the Country Morning Collage Weekly Challenge. So I'll just get that, get that out. So these prompts, it was an interesting list of prompts. Um, so hopefully I can pull it all together. So we have dark. So what I decided to do is one of my mixed media um, paint um, panels that I did. Um, I'll link that um, video in the description box below. And it, for dark, I felt, well, this is dark. This is not normally me. So that's what I consider, other than black, um, this is quite dark. So we've got that. Um, desert. So I found this picture here um, of a desert. So I got this out of a, a book that had, um, it was about... In the Middle East so I'm not sure how I'm going to use this so I'll just leave that that size until we open the page foreign language um, got this bit of Italian it's got Italian the pronunciation and then the English version so I thought well we can use that diamond and I've got all these little diamonds here so I'm thinking um, we will glue these on somehow. Um, they're just like little diamantes. So we can definitely use that. Um, and herbs. So I've got some uh, stickers here. So um, I've got basil and got flat leaf parsley. I think some of these are thyme and um, bay leaves so I'm not sure but I can definitely pick out the flat leaf parsley and the basil so I think that might be dill but we can use those so let's have a look at the page that we're using okay so it's the back of this one So we might just tear some of this off. We won't use all of it. And somehow we will use this. So maybe might use the top section of it. Somewhere like maybe that. It's quite a big picture. And we really only want like the sand and the... Um, maybe the tent... Just tear it through the middle there. So we can definitely use that. And then we've got got Italian. Maybe the Italian can go there. That can go there. And then we've got our... Maybe this can go up there. And I think that can go there. So I can sort of... So then you get to see the desert and that there.
that can go there. Reckon that can go like that. And then, so I'll get that background picture down first. go up there and I want to get this down so I'll get that Italian down first get my bit of um, mixed media painting down We want to ink that actually. Just to make that a little bit of a vintage look. That can go over here. Okay, now I've got to put those diamantes on and the basil and the flat leaf parsley. So I'll get this off. curled up a bit so it's sort of put leaf parsley there oh here it is I was wondering where I'd put the other okay Basil there. Might put another one up up here. Now, the diamonds. So my thought was, I've just got to try and get them, like, I've got quite a few. Just trying to get them on the on the glue bit. Well, 
what I'm doing is I'm virtually just dropping them and pushing them into the glue. So hopefully that'll work. And they should just sparkle everywhere. Then so this was like a little chain of diamante things, so some more on. Let's see how we go with these ones. It actually looks good that I've put them all over the place. It sort of blends it together, makes them like it makes it all connect. Now I've got two here. They seem to be stuck together. Oh, I've got them now. More glue there. there. So luckily this PVA glue dries clear and so they should show up better once the glue's dried. So hopefully you can see that. So it just sparkles the whole page. So what we have, um, the first prompt was dark. So I used my dark uh, mixed media. Um, then the desert, which is a picture in the background with the sand, the desert and the camels and tents. Foreign language, I've got um, Italian down the bottom here. Diamonds, I've found all these little diamante diamonds. So I've put them all over the page and herbs. So we've got flat leaf parsley, basil and bay leaf. So um, I hope you enjoyed that quick little collage and um, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you. Bye.